guys welcome or welcome back if you're new here my name is natasha and i am a full-time waitress i did not write down my stuff yet because i am just i don't know i like slept all day i'm like exhausted from the weekend even though it was so slow i feel like sometimes when it's slower you lose your momentum so it's like you feel more exhausted but um i did work about 25 hours uh give or take so maybe 26 27 or 24 i'm not really quite sure but I made $780 and then in singles, I made 30. So I made $810. I also did have 15 more dollars, but I spent them to get some beers after work. So those are not here. Um, but yeah, um, let's just get right into it. It's going to be a really short video because I have only my bills to stuff. If you didn't watch my uh, week in life as a server video, uh, go check that out. You can see how much I made every shift. Um, so I think I'm not going to be saying it on here how much I make every shift and how many hours I worked because I'm going to be doing it over there. So it's kind of repetitive. And if you really want to know, I guess you could just watch it over there. So my mortgage has 450. I did do a condensing video last video. That video is also a giveaway. So go check that out if you haven't entered already. It ends Friday, August 13th, and I'm doing it with Budget with Gigi. It's a collab giveaway. So go check that out. And I have one, two, three, four hundred and 50 in here for my mortgage so i have 900 and i'm gonna take this to the bank and deposit that all right and then for fence i am putting in 165 is it no it's 75 what am i saying so we have uh, um let's put in 100 and take out 25 actually so we have 150 and i did buy these trackers a while ago from the budgeting flight attendant i don't even know if she makes videos anymore i haven't seen them in a while but um, I did just cut them down because it was like wider. Um, I don't need that many boxes. So I just put a start date um, as August 1st because that's when I'm starting it. But I really have been paying this credit off credit card off longer. And my balance, starting balance was 6161. So it is so for August 1st, I did make a payment of $300. That's for the month. My balance is $4,917. And I'm just doing this to keep myself on track because I keep going onto the website or onto like the app to check. And I don't know, I just I don't I'm like a paper and pen type of person. So that's just helping me like to just keep track. Um, and then for Citibank, I'm really, really close to paying this off. It is due September 5th. So I did also make one for this, didn't I? Oops, I put into the wrong envelope. Um, I did make a tracker. No, I didn't make the tracker. I bought it from the budgeting flight attendant. I'll leave it down below. Um, but so for August 1st, I messed this up because I forgot I was going to make a minimum payment from my checking account as well as my cash stuffings. But August 1st, so I'm not paying it i'm like keeping it all together and then i'm gonna pay all of it at one time um i do pay my minimum payments so august 1st i put into my envelope 165 so i brought the balance down to 728 it's like a hypothetical balance because the balance is technically still the whole balance um but i know that how much money i have left to add to the envelope so that i can pay off the credit card um, August 4th, I put, I paid the minimum payment, which was $80 and my balance now is 648. So I am going to be putting in 165. So we have 120, 40, 65. So let's see how much we have here. So in the bank, um, we have 1,000, 2,000, 3,500. Okay, uh, 100, 200, 20, 40, 60, 80, 300, 20, 40, 55, 60. So I don't know if I have a calculator. I do not. But I will add this up in the next video. You will see how much I left I have to pay. So for, this is not August 15th. So the, all the dates are wrong now. Today is, I think, August 8th. So let's just, I paid 165. So... I'll see how much the balance dropped down. 648 minus 165. I cannot do that in my head at all. So I don't know where my calculator is. So yes, I will add that up for next video. And yeah, we're a month away, not even, from paying this back. And you will no longer see this envelope. And I will no longer have to pay $165 a week. So that's very exciting. Um, utilities. Did I pay everything? Do everything already? All right, let's see how much money we have left. 
40, 50, 60, 75, 85, 90. I'm gonna put um, $10 into utilities. And we have 15, so I'm putting in 10, we'll have 25. And then let's see how much I'm gonna do for food and gas. Um, I do have 100 miles left in my car. I have been staying at my mom's house Saturday night because I, work, I get out of work Saturday at like 11 o'clock and then I work Sunday mornings at 10 a.m. So I don't really wanna drive an hour, 30 minutes home, 30 minutes back. It's not even 30 minutes, it's 40 minutes home and 40 minutes back after working a 12 hour shift to work another 12 hour shift. So I've been sleeping at my mom's house. She lives uh, 10 minutes away from my job. Um, so I've been just sleeping at her house Saturday nights because uh, I don't have Adrian that night. So just more working out really well. And I'm probably gonna keep doing it just to save that money on gas because it is $10 each day to go back and forth from work. Um, so I have a hundred miles. I'm working five shifts this week. So minus that one day I don't drive. F so that's four shifts. It's about $10 per shift. That's 40 bucks. Um, so I'm going to put $40 and I have still that hundred miles in my gas tank. So this is enough to get to me to work every day. And then I still have a hundred miles left in my gas tank. All right. And then this is going to be for food. So let's see what we have left for food. So we have 10, 25, 35, 40, um, it is what it is. There's not really much I can do. Um, I had a really bad week at work and I'll have no paycheck again next week. So we're just going to play the same game again. If you don't watch my server, um, vlogs, go watch them so you can see what I'm talking about because, um, then you have no idea what I'm talking about. But, um, other than this, I have my savings challenges for my singles still that I'm going to be doing. And I actually got four singles for Adrian this week, which is so exciting. And I'm actually going to count his envelope since... This is going to be a short video. I'm just going to count his. So I have $50 back here in this savings challenge. And then I'm going to put the four in here and see where we are at. Um, in October, his birthday's in October. I started this last October. So I'm going to see how many singles we have for him and deposit it into his 529. So <clears throat> let's see. We have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Well, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 20. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 30. <clears throat> 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. So we have $36. So $14 more. And I will have $100 to deposit for this year for him <clears throat> starting in october for this his fifth birthday i think i'm gonna do five dollars a week every year for his fifth birthday um just because it's uh will be easier i think i will still save the singles for him because i feel like i'm already attached to the idea like when i see a single with an a i get so excited so i think i'm just gonna keep doing that so this is my hell kitty mini savings challenge and i ran out of the low numbers so i am just doing what i can now so i am going to pull this money out this money has not been colored in because i don't have a low enough number for it so we have one two three four five six and we should have 24 here which would be 30 so let's see is that right i think so no it's not one two three four five six seven eight nine ten okay one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, twenty. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So we'll do a twenty and a ten, and I have two dollars for next week's. Um, let's just color that in real quick. So I colored in this twenty and this ten. So all we have left is this forty and this twenty. So that's sixty dollars. Um. So yeah, so we are. We should have two hundred and twenty dollars in here. Um, I did take some money to the bank, I mean, not to the bank, to my job because they needed singles. So is that right? Oh, you know what? I have a $50 bill to put in here. So I actually think that I cashed up that $50. Oh my God. I think I did because I put it in with the rest of my money. I think I'm going to double check because I know I gave my my boss the $50 in singles and he gave me the $50 bill and I think I put it in with my server money so I would be off by $50 which means I have $50 less so I'm gonna see because um it was like a $50 bill um I'm gonna check to see if I have it in my bag or if not then I put it in with my server book so whatever we actually do have 170 
plus this 30 is 200. So yeah, so that's right because we have the uh, challenge is for 260. So we need 60 more dollars and then we are done with this. This went by really quick and that's kind of crazy that I accumulated that many singles within like, I want to say like it was a little bit over two months. Um, I'm probably going to bring those singles back into work as well. Um, but yeah, so I'll have um, the 40 and the 20. And then I don't know if I'm going to wait until January to start this. I am going to be doing my th singles in here. Um, I was going to start for January, but I mean, after I finish that savings challenge, maybe I'll do it one more time and then I'll start this in January because it took me a few months. I don't know, but this is going to be for um, my singles. So I made 52 so that way I can fold the money up in here um, like this and I have to close up the side still. And then I'll save them for every week and count them quarterly. So we'll see. I, I mean, I think it makes sense to start in January. So maybe I'll do the Hello Kitty mini, mini savings challenge like one more time. Um, and then I will switch to this in January because, yeah. And this mini savings challenge, I think I mentioned before, but I am using that money for my cousin's wedding. So I will give her probably like 150 for her like towards her wedding and then i'm gonna buy a dress and some shoes so that is it maybe i'll give her 200 my dress i don't know um but yeah that is it guys thank you so much for watching i'll see you guys in the next one